science is so lively, it's so, it's so human, it's so much about human and where we come from, is like the story of our life as well, you know, we, we are very small uh, compared to something very big. My name is Gilles Jabin and I'm a choreographer. We are here uh, at BAM, Brooklyn Academy of Music in New York, and uh, we just uh, presented uh, Quantum, which is a piece for six dancers with the music from Carla Scaletti and the light from Julius von Bismarck. I was residence artist in CERN, and then this is the piece that I created after my residency. So it was really interesting for me to, uh, to, to, to study all these different types of physics, and uh, I tried um, to uh, use some of the principles that are in particle physics to, to uh, generate movement for the dancer. And so the movement comes out of uh, particle physics principles. We start with a vibration. Uh, because you know there's this theory that you know that everything is vibrating there's those strings vibrating and 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 it's like there's this vibration going on and and this is something that you'll find at the quantum level but also in all uh, in our scale uh, and then they never stop moving and then as 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 the piece goes on uh, there is like some different forces that are kind of applied to 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 the ambient so maybe some magnetic forces and then they start to kind of get into one certain direction because the, the orientation of the fields that are coming in. So even also sometimes we applied some ideas of, of heat, you know, heating up the whole system. Or, and that makes, of course, a lot of differences. Well, gravity plays a big part. I didn't know that gravity was such a weak force. And uh, basically, we are really like just gently floating on top of the Earth. To know this, to start to understand this, make me kind of think that, oh, maybe we can move differently, that maybe is an ally, it's not so much something that is, um, you know, it's not a constraint for jumping, it's like it's really something I can, I can, I can use um, in terms of motion. It's a very abstract piece, but there's maybe one little thing that I wanted to be a little bit more concrete, and it's the Higgs, and because the Higgs is this particle that gives masses to, to the other particles. So one way to illustrate it is that we have this one dancer with a fist and then all the other dancers are kind of round it. And then, and then therefore, because the fist is moving and it's slowing down their, their movement. And there's the, the, the light on top, the choreography in the middle, and maybe the music from under. It's like, like really three different layers, three different worlds that just kind of get together. And it's, kind of, it's like it creates some kind of a really, um, I think, powerful environment.